Damn. Mm. This is some shoot show is some good cornbread. Oh, hey, what's up, YouTube? Go Chantin Kaichi here today with Pokemon X and Y Wi Fi battle. Now, I know what you're thinking, Gotron, how did you get this top of the line recording software? E simple answer, simple answer. Yeah, yeah, and Gotron, how can it be so cool like you to record a Pokemon X and Y Wi Fi battle with an external webcam device? Simple. I'll tell you why. All you have to do is be poor and not have a capture card, and you can do exactly what I'm doing. Yes, I know. It's, it's you can be just as cool as I am, but no, seriously. Um, I I originally wasn't going to upload Wi-Fi battles simply because I don't have the proper recording software for them, but I figured I had a really good battle, and my mic isn't horrible at picking up audio so I figured I might as well go ahead and showcase this battle so now this battle is against a per person I found randomly in my passerby which is awesome because people I had been battling online were turned out to be scrubs and it turns out to be a pretty good battle now looking at, now as you can see my team isn't the best team for the new metagame it declares a lot of weak against a standard team. I would have to play my cards right, or else I could lose easily. Um, but it's uh, I like this team. I'm proud of it. It's the first one I bred, and it has it's filled with Pokemon that I like. So that's why I'm using it. And looking at his team on paper, I thought I was gonna lose. He could have the Mega Gengar, Gyarados, or Mawile. But honestly, the only reason to use a Mawile is if it's a Mega Mawile. So. That that automatically decreases the threat of his team there, and then I figured he would really lead with his clef key to get up some taunt spike shenanigans. But um, so I go ahead and leave my Steelix. So without further ado, let's get into this match. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, now like I said, this this is a completely random person. I I don't know if he has a YouTube or not. So yeah. Anyway. I leave with my Steelix, my dear. <laughs> no, my Steelix, and he leaves with his Clefki. Now he's gonna go for the Swagger, which I wasn't expecting. I was expecting Taunt, but I should expect Swagger because you know Prankster, Swagger, um, Thunder Wave. But I go straight for the Earthquake and take it out. Um, now I was expecting. I was um, I should have went for the Stealth Rock. It would have worked out better for me to go for that, but and you'll see why later. <clears throat> Honestly, I could have played this Gyarados better, like a lot better than I did, but and you'll see what I mean in a second. So it goes for the Dragon Dance. I'm not worried. I'm a Steelix. I'm max HP, max defense. I can take one hit, especially since I have sturdy. So I go for the Stealth Rock now, which which is what I shouldn't have done. I should have gone for it against a Clef Key or just <clears throat> attack this thing twice. And that goes for the waterfall, as you can see, I tanked it pretty well. And now I go for the gyro ball, and I do about, I don't know, 30%, a little more than 30%. He's going to take me out with his waterfall. Now, I should have attacked this thing twice. Um, or went for the stealth rock against Klefki. Or, honestly, I, I, I wouldn't have misplayed if he didn't have Intimidate. Because as you can see, Sludge Bomb doesn't take it out from my Gengar. So, I lose my Gengar right here, which um, is just a bad play on my part. I could have easily saved this thing. Uh, fortunately, I ended up not needing it at all. Gengar was completely irrelevant to this battle, So, which is why I guess I kind of realized that, and I just decided to go ahead and sacrifice it because I didn't really need it. And then I just revenge kill with my Blastoise's Ice Beam as he tanks that Earthquake. So, yeah, not really a big deal. I could have saved my Gengar, but oh well. Now, he's going to, I get some leftovers recovery, and he's going to go out to Mega to his Mawile. Gets the Intimidate, doesn't matter. <coughs> Excuse me. Man. This cupcake, the, that cornbread, man, it's got me got me coughing and shit. Now, he's going to Mega Ball right here. I stay with my Black Spoils, because once again, a max HP, max defense. In this metagame, everything is physical, so... The defensive walls are needed. So I go for the Scald here. Get the burn. <coughs> Whoa. 
Man, you'd, you'd think I'm a coffin. So I get the brand, it doesn't really matter. He goes for the Swords Dance, his attack is back to neutral. Now, I knew I could take one hit from this thing, even after a Swords Dance, even if it wasn't burned. Because I am max HP, max defense. Which is why I'm not scared off, and I stay with my Blastoise. Now, he goes for a Sucker Punch right there, it doesn't do too much. And then Skull takes it down, and then the burn will take it out. And like I was saying, if he had, I hadn't got the burn, his Sucker Punch would have taken me down to, like, Torrent Range, and I would have taken it out in... Uh, actually I wouldn't have taken out one hit, but I could have easily re revenge killed that thing. And then he brings in his Gengar. Now I go for the Protect here to get a little more leftovers recovery. And uh, he goes for the Thunderbolt, which tells me his set is <coughs> most likely Sludge Bomb, Shadow Ball, um, Thunderbolt, and Focus Blast. So I take back my, I retreat my Blastoise and I go out to my Snorlax, my special defensive wall. And he completely tanks this Thunderbolt easily, 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 easily. Okay. <laughs> so he goes for a Sludge Bomb. I go for Body Slam right here because I was expecting him to want to switch out since he clearly can't do anything to me. But I guess he figured he'd just stay and get as much damage as he could. So he goes for Sludge Bomb again. And I just go ahead and go for the Crunch and take it out. So at this point, I think it's like 4-2. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 4-2. He has his Hydreigon and his Diggers be left. I'm at a good amount of health with pretty much all my Pokemon. Um, I can just rest on my Snorlax. Um, and I decide to save this thing. In case his Hydreigon decides to give me a problem. So it goes out to his hashtag Mega Punch. AKA Diggersby. And I go to my Soul Collector. <laughs> the Pincer. Because um, Pincer just destroys things and then devours their souls with his soul devouring mouth. With his, with his soul devouring teeth. So uh, he was, withdraws his Diggersby after going for the bulk up, which is cool. I haven't seen that set on Diggersby yet. And he goes out to his Hydreigon. And I make kind of a risky play right here. I Mega Evolve Swords Dance. And the reason why that's risky is because if he he could have hit me with a rock throw on his Diggersby and I would have died. <laughs> but it ends up working out. If I wouldn't have gone for the Mega Evolve, um his Hydreigon might have taken me out with something with something dangerous. So I just go ahead and take this out with an X scissor and then I aerialate thrash diggers me. And that's a good game. So yeah, that's a really good game. And um unfortunately unfortunately I don't have a way of getting this man that quick attack did way too much damage. Um unfortunately I don't have a way of getting this man's friend code or anything. Since he was just a random person I battled on my passerby, but it's, this is the best battle I've had with this team so far. And um, that's why I wanted to... So yeah, probably won't be uploading much more of these unless it's a good battle or if I showcase a cool Pokemon that no one uses. Or if my opponent showcases a cool Pokemon that no one uses. Like later I'll probably have some, you know, Swift Swim Golduck coming, some Water Absorb Polyrath. Polyrath, I'm pretty sure Polyrath got an attack buff. I think it's in base 95 now instead of base 85, but I'm not 100%, but so I'll be using some of that. <coughs> and yeah, just a bunch of cool Pokemon I like will be coming, so go try and take IG out, YouTube, I'll talk to you later. I'm going to go drink some water, because I feel like um, I'm breathing in some air from a coughing or something right now, and that's just not good. So, uh, peace. <coughs> Oh, <laughs> oh,